Hello, welcome to Maximity's next 2 minute Tuesday, my name is Bronya, and if you've ever wanted how people use Excel with just a keyboard, I'm about to show you. I've opened up Excel and put my cursor to the bottom right of the page. I'm going to create a table that's going to show how many studio albums and live albums have been released by a set of bands. In cell A1 I'm just going to type date and then press the tab key to move to the cell on the right. Now in cell B1 I'm going to hold down the control key and press the semicolon to insert today's date. Press enter to move to the next row or the directional keys to navigate between the cells. I'm now going to put some headers in row 2 by typing band, pressing tab, type studio albums, tab again and then live albums. I'm now just going to fill in a list of bands and how many albums they've released. I want to turn this data into a chart now so I'm going to need to highlight the cells. I'm going to go back to cell A1 by holding down control and pressing home. Now I'll tap the down direction key to move into cell A2. I'm now going to hold down control and shift keys and tap down one more time. You'll now see that I've highlighted everything between cell A2 and A6. While still holding down the shift and control keys, tap the right direction key to highlight the rest of the data. If you hold shift and press down, it will highlight the next cell. If you hold shift and control, it will highlight everything until the data ends. With everything between cell A2 and C6 highlighted, tap the Alt key and you'll notice letters appearing along the ribbon tabs at the top of the page. We want to insert a chart, so we're going to tap N for insert. Now we can select the option to create a bar chart by typing C1, which brings up the drop down. Navigate to your preferred chart with the direction keys and press Enter. And you can now use the direction keys to move your chart around the page. 